Kanu is here to reclaim his position at the top, of, at the top echelons of, of the country's leadership. This is Kanu Sasa. After 20 years since the Independent Party filled a candidate, the party backed by its delegates drawn in hundreds from across the country through their weight behind Gideon Moy. The party's last taste of power was in 2002 when the late President Moy relinquished power to Mwai Kibaki. Since then, the Independence Party has remained dormant in the political scene. The Kanu chairman B and is hereby nominated as the presidential candidate for the Kanu for the Kenya African National Wakin Union Jamba, Kanu Jamba. in the coming general elections of 2022. In the 2007 election, the party chose to give a backing to Mwaiki Baki in the consequent elections through their weight behind President Uru Kenyatta. But now Gideon Moy says that the party is back in full swing and rejuvenated, ready to relieve Kenyans from the current tax burden. Our obligation is to look after the poor and marginalized and remove the burdens that prevent a majority from prospering, period. Moi's endorsement follows heightened political activities in the country as presidential contenders line up to succeed President Uru Kenyatta, including his fellow co-principals from the One Kenya Alliance, who are by his side as he took one of the big steps of his political career. Tutazidi kuongea, tutazidi kujadiliana, tutazidi kushauriana. Kwa sababu mimi kwa niaba ya ANC, hatuna lengo lengine. Tuna lengo la kusema tunataka Kenya inawiri. Huyu, Gideon. Hata kama wengine watakuacha, you know I can't. Na kama wengine watatuacha. Na kama wengine wata, wataniacha mimi, najua Gideon awezi kuniacha. The team behind you here, plus also the Prime Minister, the former Prime Minister, Laira Amoro Odinga, will be the team that will form the next government. I have no doubt in my mind. Ukitembea huko inje, you might not appreciate having a place to go and put your head at the end of the day. If we take this affair lightly, we might not have a home in this country next year. We all must commit ourselves, starting with me, on ensuring we work as a team, and success will come because we are a team. According to trusted sources, however, each of the One Kenya Alliance that have announced their ambitions are expected to launch their presidential bid before finally rallying behind Odinga in a formidable coalition. Odinga, who was the chief guest at the event, promised to work with Gideon as he recalled his journey with the former ruling party where he was the secretary general before the walkout that led to the formation of the NAC government. There must be tolerance among political parties. Political competition is healthy in our country. It strengthens our democracy. And that is the best way to make our country grow and prosper. All eyes are now led towards the One Kenya Alliance on whether it will stand the test of time and who will be the flag bearer of the said coalition. Martin Opio, K24 TV. Oh!